Do you want to know the best AI tools which you can use daily at your work? Then this video is for you. There are a lot of AI tools, but these five AI tools are the best because they help you automate your redundant tasks and also provide efficient output. Manoj here, a product manager and content creator. I already made a video on learning about AI, fundamentals of AI and generative AI. So do check that video if you want. Here, let's get into the first AI tool. So the first in the list is known as Napkin AI. Napkin AI helps you to visualize concepts, right? Easily in the form of mind maps, and visually good things which you can add in your slide decks instead of text. So let's say top five problems faced by job seekers. So it represents it in a very visual manner, right? So let's say I want to visualize this thing. Uh, so if I just need to click on that, it helps you visualize that lack of experience in this job seekers, right? So this is an overall summary. So the mind map is really good, right? So you can download it. You can change colors, right? You can change the aspect ratio. You can change the style, right? You can do a lot of more things like let's say I like vibrant colors so I can just change the style and much more, right? And you can directly use it in your slide deck according. This, this is a really good tool and it helps you to represent what you want, maybe explain to stakeholders or your team members better. And next is Gamma AI. So Gamma AI helps you to create presentations faster. You can create a presentation, you can generate a presentation, right? So let's say I will generate like best way about AI. Okay, so it will generate an outline for me now. So, and it also generates like a slide deck. So it's very quick, right? I can also choose the style. So let's say I like dark theme, maybe more. Okay, I will use AI images. Uh, so you can also choose between different models. So I click on generate. So it has total eight slide decks. So imagine, right? So let's say you already have a PRD or some content which you have already written, right? You can feed it and quickly generate like a slide deck. And it's very good, right? For example, if you see like how like good it is in terms of the style we have chosen, we can change the style if we want. So it has already generated it as icons, right? So it's already generating it. So I can quickly present it maybe uh, the first deck, right? So yeah, it's, it's really good. It's already generating, right? So you can use it to create slide decks if you want, like in a very easy to understand manner. And next is Claude. Claude is very good for data analysis, right? So if you're someone like a data analyst or into product management, you can also use for other purposes. Let's say it's very good for data analysis. So I'll show you a quick demo, right? So here's a Swiggy data. For example, it says the date of order, what was order, the item ID, the item name, etc. right? The item category. So I've uploaded this data to Claude. Okay. So now it analyzes it. So now I can ask it any question I want. So let's say, let's assume like I will tell help me understand the category uh, sales split so i can ask it right so so it's already analyzing the data set so it would take some time so we can come back to this uh, later once once it does analyze so the next is the vibe coding tool okay which is known as v0.dev so it helps you to build apps without writing code so if you see here uh add just written like few lines of uh, text and it already made an app for me. So this is a live weather app. So where I can compare, okay, between Chennai and let's say Coimbatore, for example, right? And I can just say, okay, what's the temperature difference here, right? So it tells like, okay, what's the temperature difference between Chennai and Coimbatore and with some more warmer city, right? If I want to live. So I can also change the logic and this basically dynamic. So it's connected to an API, by the way. So I can also compare. So it gives the real data. So let's say Mumbai, right? I can maybe type, okay, Rajasthan, something like, so yeah. So see, warmer cities. This is how it works. So I also generated another app, which is known as a salary estimator, where you put down all the salaries and it says what's the salary estimate, right? And I built it within less than an hour or even less than 30 minutes. So you can also use tools like v0.dev to quickly build apps. Uh, so the next one is uh, App Alchemy AI. So App Alchemy AI is a tool which is similar to v0.dev. v0.dev helps you to build web apps, whereas App Alchemy.ai helps you to build mobile apps. So it's similar to uh, v0 only. So I can just show an example, right? So see this app, right? So it's really custom, right? It has all the Android features. So if you see the cards, the CT8, it really looks like very custom made for a mobile app, right? 
and it thinks a lot. So you see the design prompt that the user has given and it is built like a very decent app. The design is really good. The next tool which will help you is known as Notebook LM. So it saves you a lot of time in learning. So for example, let's say I want to learn generative AI and I see like a Sam Altman stock on TED. So I can just copy that thing and maybe upload. So let's say you can, uh, so it's by Google. So it has all the custom integrations. So I can uh, get direct video links. So, so I can just copy, I can just insert. So as soon as I insert, what happens is all the video transcript is getting, getting into the notebook LM. Now I can ask, okay, summarize what he told about the future of chat GPT, chat GPT. And it will tell me like, and it's more constrained to this. So it doesn't tell from the internet, right? And it has also summarized, right? The transcript captures a discussion between Chris and Sam Altman. So it, it has told what, what Sam Altman has told. And it also gives references from the exact talk, right? So this helps you to quickly learn things. So let's say instead of I watching this 45 minute video, I can quickly import it into notebook LM and start learning, right? Start asking the questions I have. Imagine like a nine, 10 hour video, right? Uh, which will help you a lot. I think we were talking about the Claude, right? It was analyzing it. So let's say it says analyze. So I was telling, okay, tell me top 10 item names based on the number of orders. And it have told, okay, samosa, gulab jamun, etc., right? And I've told, okay, can you draw a pie chart representation of this? And it has drawn it, right? Can you do like a GMV analysis by category, right? The total value, sweets were the highest, right? Rasgulla was highest in that. So I think it has done a good analysis. So if I had to do it manually, maybe via Excel, or let's assume a person, I don't know anything about Excel. This is very useful, right? I can quickly do analysis and it tells me the results. I can ask more questions to that. So thanks a lot for watching this video. Do like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel. All AI tools are attached in the description. Do subscribe for more AI content. Thank you and have a nice day.